check. Okay. Um. Huh. God damn it. Well, the first time I, I, I started up this stream, I didn't check to make sure that my audio was working. And uh, it turns out that all of my audio got messed up for some reason in OBS. And um, I spent five minutes reading the opening speech from Patton, and nobody heard any of it. So I gotta go do that all over again. <clears throat> all right, be seated. Now I want you to remember that no bastard ever won a war by dying for his country. He won it by making the other poor bastard die for his country. Men, all you've heard the stuff this heard all this stuff you've heard about America not wanting to fight, wanting to stay out of the war is a lot lot of horse dung. Americans traditionally love to fight. All Americans real love the sting of battle. Well, when you were kids, you all admire the champion marble shooter, the fastest runner, the big league ball players, and the toughest boxers. Americans love a winner, and they will not tolerate a loser. Americans play to win all the time. Now, I wouldn't give a hoot in hell for a man who lost and laughed. That's why Americans have never lost and will never lose a war, because the very thought of losing is hateful to Americans. Now. An army is a team. It lives, eats, sleeps, fights as a team. This individualist individuality stuff is a bunch of crap. The bilious bastards who wrote that stuff about individuality for the Saturday Evening Post don't know anything more about real battle than do they do about fucking. Now, we have the finest food and equipment, the best spirit, and the best men in the world. You know, by God... I actually pity those poor alien bastards we're going up against. By God, I do. We're not just going to shoot the bastards. We're going to cut out their living guts and use them to grease the treads of our tanks. We're going to murder those lousy gray bastards by the bushel. Now, some of you guys I know are wondering whether or not you will chicken out under fire. Don't worry about it. I can assure you that you will all do your duty. The gray, gray aliens are the enemy. Wade into them. Spill their blood. Shoot them in the belly. When you put your hand into a bunch of goo that a moment before was your best friend's face, you'll know what to do. Now, there's another thing I want you to remember. I don't want to get any messages saying that we are holding our position. We're not holding anything. Let the aliens do that. We are advancing constantly, and we're not interested in holding on to anything except the enemy. We're going to hold on to him by the nose, and we're going to kick him in the ass. We're going to kick the hell out of him all the time, and we're going to go through him like crap through a goose. Now, there's one thing that you'll all be able to say when you get back home, and you may thank God for it. Thirty years from now, when you're sitting around the fireside with your grandson on your knee, he asks you, what did you do while Clef was playing Phoenix Point? You won't have to say. Well, I was rolling for waifus in Fate Grand Order. All right, you sons of bitches. You know how I feel. Oh, I will be proud to lead you wonderful guys into battle anytime, anywhere. That is all. What? No. <laughs> it's a speech from Patton. Violet Skies. You've never seen Patton? Ah. The first five minutes of Patton are legendary. Anyway. Unless it's a farm. If fighting is sure to bring victory, then you must fight. Sun Tzu said that. 
And I think he knows a little bit more about fighting than you do, pal, because he invented it. And then he perfected it so that no man could defeat him in the Ring of Honor. And then he got bought, took his fight money, and he bought two of every animal on Earth. And he herded them into a boat. And then he beat the living crap out of every single one of them. And from that day forward, anytime a bunch of animals are together in one place, we call it a zoo. Unless it's a farm. Alright. Oh. Uh... Wow, okay. Uh, let's play on Veteran. Let's use the pro prologue and tutorial. And let's start the game. So what is this? Uh, Alright, this is Phoenix Point. Uh, Phoenix Point, if you guys are familiar with the XCON games... Refugees are coming from the coast. 400 yesterday. This is the game that the original X guy who made the original 1990 something XCOM uh, decided to make. We listened to the number stations every day. I took turns with Jacob waiting for our signal. And finally, it came. A scarab got it too. It's AI directing it to our rendezvous point. We had no news from Symes for many months. Did he send the activation codes? I was desperate to know what happened to him. The mutants were on the march again. Something was happening. If the mist was back, then it meant that the Pandora virus was mutating again, twisting the human form into new horrors. We needed to regroup, rebuild. But first, we had to get to that scarab. All right. This is our setting. It's the post-apocalypse. Humankind has been mutated into horrible monsters by a deadly virus called the Pandora virus. We are going to go kick some mutant ass. Give me one second, and let's begin. All right, standard camera controls, rotate... Zoom in, zoom out. This Looks is the good. rendezvous point. The scarab is waiting for us right over there. All right, so it's a uh, moving in quick. Right click to move, Tango just time. like XCOM. Uh, cover system, just like XCOM. All right, let's see if our friend. All right, let's get him over to here. There. All right, fire. Ready to engage. And let's fire. All right, one dead alien. Oh, more Pandoran. They're practically aliens. All right, what's my? All right, hit F to shoot, and this is what makes the game interesting. Instead of most of these types of tactics games, which just use a dice roll, this one actually has a system where you can free aim in the 3D space and try to get a shot off. I'm gonna aim. Yeah, let's aim for the head. Nice. This must be the scarab. It's seen better days, but it will have to do. Jump inside. Okay. All right. I don't like this building. It looks like somebody's going to probably jump out of there. So let's get you. Actually, let's switch to mo this guy over here. All right, get him to open. Oh. One over here, one over here. All right. Um, I think my best chance is going to be... Let's I'm move to move. here. And let's get a... Let's get a shot off. Uh, let's just fire. Okay. And 
Sophia Brown is gonna move to there. I want her... Yes, I do want to end my turn. <laughs> Always shoot the groin. Uh, is this a sequel to the Phoenix Wright games? No, it's not. Although that would be awesome. Alright, I got three of these guys moving in. Okay, that's gonna be... Alright, let's see if we can clear these guys out first. This guy... Oh, his movement is 20... I, I wonder. Okay, so I can't tell what their movement speed is like. But let's see. Yeah, let's let's do this. Let's free aim. I guess I can aim for the groin. Yeah. All right, I got one guy here. That guy's gonna be a problem, and I don't have shot shot on him. Uh, let's see if my buddy here, Jacob Eber. Oh, don't don't do that. Can get the shot off. Uh, let's go to let's sh let's shoot from here. Uh, shoot. All right, good. Let's move to here. And you heading up. Move up to here. I think this guy is a melee only enemy, so I want to keep my distance. Pipes ready to be devoured. Okay, so he is melee only, but he's got a f quick speed. Alright. Um, let's have you... Fire. Good. And just start running. Let's get Frendo up to here. I think that's all the enemies. Alright, and let's get Splendid. you... Over to the vehicle. Yes. Watch All right. In. Let's get you over to that vehicle too. All right, there we go. Okay, status injured. All right. Factions! Huh. Okay, that's interesting. After several hours traveling, the howling noises stopped. Let's get this back to here. And then so did the scarab. I did a quick survey around our position while Jacob talked to the AI. There was an abandoned government reclamation station nearby. These places are usually good for scavenging supplies and equipment, but they often attracted desperate gangs. The AI gave us the reason for our stop. An emergency rescue... Sorry. No, ...from another Phoenix operative. We had a location, too. Right in the middle of that station. The Scarab made it clear that we should attempt a rescue before continuing with our journey. Despite... We've got visual on the building. All right. The Phoenix operatives should be close by. There are hostiles up ahead, so stay vigilant. Okay, four action points to be used in any order. Alright, so one action point gets me to here. Two gets me to here. Three gets me to here. Four gets me to here. Two action points to shoot, two to go on overwatch, standby costs nothing, reload. Um, current weapon ammunition will be lost. Okay, so I have limited magazines, uh, so I need to be careful with how I do my reloads. Uh, this is a medikit? Okay, good. That's useful to have. Alright, let's see. I have no idea what this is going to be like. 
Okay, sinking. I'm gonna presume that I'm gonna wanna. I don't not like that signal. I don't like that symbol either. I'm gonna presume my safest route is to go run across, stop here, and then see if I can get to this building. All right, let's see. Oh! Uh, enemy already spotted. What is that? Oh, that's a bandit. Human enemy, looks like. Okay, let's I'm get you to here. Nothing's getting past me. Okay, that's low cover. I don't have a weapon. Oh. Uh, let's free aim. Let's, let's go for the head. Okay, Jacob's turn. Okay, that he can get line of sight from here. Come uh, get some. Zoom. Alright, good job. Okay. Uh maybe I should have had them hop into the vehicle. Tell you what, I'll move the vehicle up to about here. In the next round, I can have them hop in. Mm. Yeah, let's scout with the vehicle first, actually. The scarab. Okay, I'm not seeing anything. All right. Yeah. We'll have you hop in. We'll have you. Get to there. Okay. Don't have the vehicle go this way. Oh! I did not want to do that. Oh! Um. Good. Hey, Acrian, how are you doing? Alright, uh, let's have you... What does this do? Oh, equipment. Uh, exit the vehicle. Okay, two action points to enter and exit the vehicle. Good to know. And... I'll have you... Jacob will move over to here and get Omar. Okay, ideal frontline operative. Alright, let's move the scarab. Uh, let's move it up this way. Strategic game. Jet jump? Oh, okay. Um, so first I need to get this guy out of the way. Then I need to have you step out from home. there. And then I think I can jet jump. I can't jet jump to there, can I? Uh, let's have you jet I jump to here. Alright, this is safe. Uh, this is safe. Independent. 
pendant. Okay, bandit there. Okay, blue and yellow lines. Got it. Let's see Sophia Brown. Can I get to a spot that has cover? Uh, if I get on top of this pipe, hopefully that's not an explosive pipe. Uh, oh boy, that's not good range. Um, Overwatch. Okay. Alright, so Overwatch is a cone. Let's... Let's Overwatch that. No, Overwatch is a... It's eating clap. <laughs> Uh, Snake boy. All right, Omar can jump, and then we'll have him. Okay, gun. Okay, gun. Ammo. Ammo. Backpack. All right. Reloading. Wait, is reloading free? Reloading zero action points, but uh, current weapon ammunition will be lost. Okay. So I can do a quick tactical reload if I need to. But hopefully won't need to. Okay, I got line of sight from there. Field runners when I'm around eight. Okay. It's a bit complex. But alright. That didn't do me much good. Um okay, well, how many shots do I have with this? I think it's three shots. Okay, I don't want to use them all up on one guy. Uh, let's move up here under cover from that guy so I can... Okay, reinforcement. Okay, so this is where new enemies come in. He thinking and just want to murder. Oh, fair point. Uh, equipment damaged. Ready to roll. All right, let's see where Omar is. Does Omar have line of sight to anybody? Can Omar get line of sight to anybody? Omar could drop down to here. But that doesn't do me much good. He could... There's that guy inside there. Let me see. That doesn't give me any cover. Flying is three action points, which would mean I can't shoot. And this would give me partial cover. Which I guess is not too bad. Here I come. Acquiring targets. Let's free aim. I'm gonna shoot the guy in the butt. Oh wow! That's neat. All right, let's get to here. Let's have you do Overwatch and make sure they can't. Okay, you're, I'm gonna have you Overwatch this side. Jacob, meanwhile, will get over to here, and I know there's a guy in here, so I'll have you overwatch that way, and 
now have the Scarab move to here, so it's behind a little bit of cover. And we'll wait. Chest devs are a bunch of lazy uh, ass. You haven't uh, heard of Chess 2? Or five-dimensional chess with uh, time travel. Multiversal chess with time travel. Alright. Come on. Do something cool. Ah! Useless. Alright. Let's see. What is my current setup looking like? Alright. Enemy here, here, and here. I've got this guy here. I think what I want to do is I want to see if I can get get an L shape going. If I can get two guys here shooting here, and if I can get these two over here and fire down this lane, that might not be a bad place to be. Uh, let's begin. Yeah, let's I'm get you over in. here where you can get line of sight to two of them. Uh, let's have you. What's my weapons? What's my 24 out of 36. That's plenty. Uh, yeah, let's get... What if, oh, free aim doesn't get me anything. You know what? You go to Overwatch and stop a control and... Oh! That's neat. Okay, so that cover is stopping me from getting a great line, but I can still Area hopefully covered. prevent this guy from doing anything too crazy. Uh, Scarab, we'll have you move out. And I want you... I got eight missiles. Bomb. This gentleman here. Okay, Jacob, do you have line of sight? Alright, let's free aim. And let's just go. Nice! Let's get you moving. Is there any? Is there a spot you can move that's better? Um, I don't know if I want to get put you in the truck. Uh, let's just have you move up to here. I think that's safe. Omar, meanwhile, uh, what do you have? Who do you have line of sight on? Okay, so my gun costs three action points to use. Let's just. Oh, I have no line of sight. Buddy. Hmm. That's going to be a slight problem. You know what? Let's do this. Let's have you overwatch. Hmm. Yeah, let's have you displace. Oh! Duh. I can, uh, I can split action points. Okay. It's free aim. Oh, the free aim isn't great. But I might be able to get you in the arm. Alright, dazed. Uh, let's get you... Back into cover. Was Social Wars a... Uh, strategy game? My camera is flashing and seems a bit laggy. Oh, boy. Hang on. Uh, it's it's the weird it's the filter I'm using. It's a little bit off. Give me a second. And let me try that again. I think, honestly, it's uh, having trouble. Alright, let's try this now. Oh my gosh. 
Okay, so it's 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 the uh, it's the filter. All right, let's let's take it off. Oops. Let's try this now. All right. Shame. Okay. So I think what it might be is let me try something real fast. Let's switch you from this. Uh, no. Okay. All right, it's my camera's just going to be laggy. I don't know why. I'll have to see if I can fix that. Oh, desk! Got your new PC. Nice. Nice. Alright. Alright. Oh, jeez. Okay. That's gonna be a slight problem. Um, your... The Overwatch didn't trigger. Alright. Okay, let's try this. Default skin. Yeah, fair enough. Uh, let's free... Where are you? Oh, that's annoying. What is causing that? Oh, there's a... There's something in the way. Alright, let's just have you shoot. That's not bad. Let's have you stay still. Um, how do I want to do this? Where... Guy here. Guy here. Okay. Let's do this. Truck moves to here. Fires a shot. Let's bomb this guy. Ah! Alright, as for you... This is a really bad idea. Let's do it. Ready to engage. Actually, let's see if I can shoot. shoot. Let's see if I can shoot his gun. Okay, and Omar. Where can I move you that you'll get line of sight on that guy around the corner? Apparently the answer is... nowhere. Um, hmm. That's gonna be a problem. Let's overwatch. Yeah, let's see how this goes. Oh, that's not good. Okay. Oh, that's really not good. Yeah, I knew that was a bad idea when I did it. I might be losing my first soldier soon. Alright. Yeah, I was trying to be clever. Eyes peeled. As for you, oh, you got to reload. Uh, you know what? Run back. It enter the vehicle. Get get a medevac. Uh, you will fire this missile over at this guy. 
Very nice. You have a hoodie instead of the Hawaii shirt. <laughs> Who are you? It's cold! The Hawaiian shirt is not very warm. Alright, can I move to a spot where I can get line of sight? Alright, guess the there. And let's free aim. Shoot him. Yeah. Oh my, right. is it? Glad you found some gear, because you're going to need it. Now you're part of my squad. Hmm. All right, there we go. Hmm. Jacob was injured. Scarab, unmodified. Experience, two skill points. All operatives must survive, kill all enemies. Okay. Drink some fucking water already! Fine, I'll drink something. Pandorans will build bases under mist cover. After but the they're... battle, the scarab resumed its course towards our base, struggling through the rough terrain. Strange growths were contorting the road, smashing against its armor. It wasn't long before it took one too many hits. The engine gave a loud crack, and the AI went dark. We had lost a valuable member of the team. We knew we were close to our destination, but we didn't know what we would find there. If we were to advance on foot, we had to exercise extreme caution. Approaching the base, we heard gunshots. Jacob and Omar took positions by my side. What was going on inside? A bandit ambush or something much worse? Following Phoenix protocol, we readied our weapons. It is time to reclaim have I our watched home. Have I watched Love, Death, and Robots? Yes, I have. Uh, Let's get rid of them and clean up this mess. First three seasons. Um, Zima Blue was very good. Okay. Huh. All right. Let's see. Um. So it looks like this is the back. I think this is going to be a advance. Okay. Um, this is a dead end, so I want to keep an eye on it, but n I don't need to send... I don't need to split the squad. Okay, it looks like a pretty straightforward uh, one-way one -way move. Uh, you'll go to here. Oh, what the hell is that? Poison worm. Nasty. I'm on the move. Are you French? Jacob Iber. I am French. Live until 3 a.m. today. I forgot time zones. Novels. Oh, yeah. Very Pulse of the Machine is good, too. Um, I will say that uh, when I found out a lot of the Love, Death, and Robots uh, animations were based off of science fiction short stories, I did go back and I did go and read some of them. And to be blunt, a lot of the stories are Enemy spotted what another poison worm. Uh, what is this thing like? Um, re retail radius. I don't know what its speed is. Um, movement six. Okay, so I think two of them. Plus an ally. Okay, I need to go rescue her. But not yet. Uh, let's... Yeah, let's...
let's just set up for in case anyone comes down this way. Yeah, let's end the turn. Oh, that doesn't look good. Oh, that must. No visual, but I can hear commotion coming from the hangar. We must investigate. Oh, I like that. So it gives me a uh, a sound thing. Okay. All right. Let's see. What can I do? Um. Omar, can you get line of sight on that worm? No. Sophia, can you get line of sight on that worm? Uh, wait, is there still a worm? I guess... I guess the worm killed itself. Okay. Let's go. Another one or two hours, maybe? What's the time for you? A cipher handgun. Okay. Uh, ground. I don't need that. Ooh, let's do that. Let's get a grenade. Oh, not enough action points. Let's have you. Let's have you get a grenade, and you'll hold on to that med kit. All right. We've got a poison worm situation. Somebody get a med kit. All right, you do it. Uh, use a med kit on her. set. Let's move on. Irina Sokolova. Okay, you'll run up and you'll get that pistol next round. Um, Jacob. Let's move you up to here. Steady. Take overwatch positions and wait for them to come. I'm aware. Okay, let's have you overwatch down this corridor. And Omar, uh, just run to here. You'll set up overwatch next turn. I'm on the move. Yeah. Pandorans. Rolling out. Okay. Arthron. All right. Set up Overwatch. Sophia. Yeah. Let's just get you up Moving to here. You uh, get a backup weapon, some ammo, and a med kit. I moved there. And Omar. Uh, can you overwatch? Let's have you overwatch like this, On overwatch. just in case Thank anyone you. tries to charge our friend. Alright. 
let's see how this goes. School tomorrow, so sleeping is not a choice. Fair point. Okay, not terrible. Alright, come on, do do this. Nice! Nice work, Omar. Good shot. Mind fragger! That sounds terrible! Set a short range Overwatch cone and shoot it as it approaches. Okay, we'll have you move to here. And set Overwatch. Like that. You. I'm on the move. Go to here. I think these guys are all melee, so I think I should be able to safely have my guys set up in Overwatch. Rolling out. We'll just set up a bunch of crisscrossing Overwatch cones like this. And anybody who comes into that area is gonna just get wrecked. Where's the French guy? I ate him. Nice! This is the French guy, Jacob Iber! Here I am. Let's do this. Uh, grenade! I bet there's a guy up here. Oh, yeah, that's right. There is a guy up there. So Omar will set up Overwatch for anyone On crossing Overwatch. into there. Let them come. You're fine. Sophia. Let's see if I can get you a lovely little shot on that worm. Missed by this much. I guess not. Uh, Irina. Uh, set up an Overwatch shot. Like this. Now, technically, I'm not supposed to do this, because this is a bad idea. Uh, shooting past another person would not happen in real life. But... This is video games. Sophia. Omar. Get to here. Irina. Get to here. Yeah. French people don't exist, lol. I don't know what kind of information you're getting. Here I am. Let's do this. All right. Overwatch to here. Sophia Brown, Overwatch. Yeah. Area covered. That way. Omar Ashur, Irina. All right, let's see. Not bad. There's another mine. Oh, it got my friend. It got me. Oh. Oh, that's not good. Ready, willing, and able. Irina.
Let's see if you can do this. Nice! Good shot. Moving in quick. The door is shut, so we'll have to use those ladders. Go, go, go! The door is shut, so we have to use the ladders? Okay. If that's what you say so. Alright. Going in. They can't stop me. All right, Jacob. You're going up a ladder. Here I am. Let's do this. All right, I am seeing no enemies around, so I'm going to presume maybe wrongfully so that it's safe to move up to here. Australia doesn't exist, and Aussie actors are actors hired by NASA. Ah, oh boy. What the hell are you guys talking about? Not enough action points. Okay. Omar, let's get you front and center where you belong. And Irina... I don't like the fact that that door just opened up. Uh, where's Omar? Okay, I need to get Jacob out of the way first, I guess. I'm on the move. Omar. Irina. Watch out, I'm moving in. Watch out, I'm moving in. It's rolling out. Alright, so there's something down here. Um, let's see. Okay, I can jump down. I'm going in. Somebody bash that thing off his face. I can hit. I can bash. Oh, it damages my gun. Good to know. Takeshi Sato. Moving out. Irina. Okay, I'm let's here. see. Omar. Operative on the move. Let's set you to overwatch. Like that. I'll keep both eyes open. Can she move to here and set up an overwatch here in case we get attacked in that direction? Uh, Jacob, meanwhile. I'll be right there. Drop down to here and set up an overwatch in case we get attacked in this direction. Area covered. Uh, Sophia, set up an overwatch in this direction too. Nothing's getting past me. Irina. Cool. 
I don't know, just in case something comes through this door. Area covered. Nice. Alright, wrong door. But that's not the worst situation to be in. Alright, we got... Alright, let's do this. Uh, where is... Irina? Got it. Fire weapon. Uh, let's free aim. Uh, any kind of shot seems to do it. Oh, that's close. And let's move you over to here. Omar, can you get a shot Fire on that targets. guy? Alright, I just need one. That works. Uh, Takeshi, do you have line of sight? Fantastic. Let's go for the... Let's go for the head. Perfect. Kills confirmed. Phoenix, welcome home. Alright. Nice. Not bad. That worked out pretty well. All right, I got a couple of levels. I don't know the what that does me. The of Phoenix Point was just the first step on our path ahead. A desperate fight against an overwhelming foe, and only a handful of friends to help. But if this base could withstand the attack, then so could we, and so could Symes. If our leader was somewhere out there, we had to re-establish contact, no matter the cost. All right. So here we are, the Phoenix organization looking to fight against the Pandorans and the bandits of the Waste. We've re-established our, uh, our uh, base, and now it's time to get into the uh, next portion of the game, looks like. The Phoenix Project was founded on October 24th, 1945. Hmm. The Second War to End All Wars was over. But there were those who understood that we could no longer afford to think in terms of nations and empires. For a time, the Phoenix Project successfully navigated the political conflicts of its era. Mm -hmm. That was our golden age. Phoenix Project operatives scoured the world for clues. We had bases in two dozen countries. Even the heavens were not off limits. But out there, on the far side <laughs> of the world, began our downfall. The failure of the Phoenix 2 mission uh -huh. exposed us to our enemies in the UN, stripped of resources and scattered to the winds. We were reduced to a secret, a memory. When the Pandora virus woke up, we should have been the first line of defense. When huge clouds of mist appeared over the sea, when people started vanishing, we should have figured out what was going on. Mm -hmm. And when those people started coming back, changed, hostile. Alien. We should have been ready to fight, but we failed. The ecosystem started to change, imperceptibly at first, then faster and faster. Mm -hmm. Three factions arose. New Jericho, trying to restore order and purity. Sinedrin, hoping to build a world without hierarchies. Uh -huh. And the Disciples of Anu, a new syncretic religion dedicated to adaptation and biological change uh-huh at war with the world and at odds with each other these factions cannot find a way forward now the mist is returning and armies are rising from the sea without the phoenix project humanity will fall it's time to rise from the ashes okay so we are a multinational organization, um, possibly uh, under the auspices of the United Nations. Our goal was to protect the world, and we failed. Now we need to reunite the uh, factions, find out what's going on with the Pandora virus, and save the world. All right. 
and let's select the bases button. Your base is your stronghold, containing all facilities, well as well as food materials and tech. Phoenix Point is in bad shape. You need to repair your... Ooh, before you can launch your manticore. Nuke it and kill everybody. I think that's the bad ending. Alright, repair facility. Go. Alright, I see. Okay. Let's return to the geoscape. Hit the button. Alright. Let's go to personnel. Uh, edit unit. Equip, ready, armor, and mounts. Okay. Uh, increase strength, willpower, and speed, as well as acquire new abilities. Uh, Phoenix SPs, oh, okay, so that's the shared uh, skill pool. Uh, can only acquire, okay, can specialize in an additional class. All right, let's take a look at Jacob. Um, what does strength do? I've got 30 skill points and 8 Phoenix points. 15 speed. Strength, willpower, uh, assault rifle training, and self-defense specialist. Uh, dash, return fire. Okay. Does return fire... Let's use... Let's get return fire. I got 15 more points. Uh, let's get dash. Okay, let's see. Alright, so that's Jacob Ever. What is this? Cynedrin Rifle? Deimos LR uh, Phoenix Assault Rifle. Damage 30. How does that compare to... Okay, so it's an Ares AR-1. Odin Body Armor. Legathon. Whatever that is. Cynedrin Equipment. Okay. How does this compare? Oh. Huh. Wait one. Uh, armor 18. Armor 20. Slightly slower. Gives me an accuracy bonus. You know what? We're going to keep you like this for now. Let's take a look at you, Sophia Brown. Uh, sniperist, thief. Twenty-five percent bonus stealth. What is your class actually? Because Jacob is what? I guess you're an assault. Heavy. Assault. Sniper. Okay, so this is actually the first class that I get. And I guess these are kind of randomized? What is my... Exception 35. Accuracy. You know? Let's give you stealth. And let's also give you a dash. Alright, what do I have? Do I have any armor that increases stealth? Nope. But that should be fine, alright. Omar. Hey, you're all set. You don't really have enough 
points to do anything. See with one of the plushy dinosaur. Yeah. S same time with the Mastuar machine. What's the Mastuar machine? I don't understand. Takeshi Sato, salt training, Irina. You're okay, Banshee helmet. Uh oh. Okay. So I guess this is all just... Alright. So this is actually armor for assault. Okay, so each of these guys has different armor. Um, then in that case, which one of these gave the accuracy bonus? Yeah, let's put you in this one, Jacob. I think you'll look good in blue. Yeah. How does this compare? Active range 32, active effective range 25. Uh, action points 2, ammo capacity 36. 60, weight, shred 1. Burst 6, effective range 30. You know what? I might as well just give you this thing. Yeah. Yeah! That looks pretty nice. Dinosaur museum, dinosaur claws, stab stab. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's see. Can I recruit new people? Assault, return fire. Okay, I guess that's it. Manticore is your aircraft. We're transporting. Okay, that's my Sky Ranger. Send your. Right, select the unexplored site. Move. Alright. Now we explore the site. Okay! Scavenging mission, then. Okay, I, I, I do like the whole... The, the fact that there are... Oh! Uh, stab! Uh, little kid Moko was visiting the museums with his parents. Uh, yeah, um... I'll tell this story. Cupcake is tasty. Uh, I'm visiting the dinosaur museum with my parents. I'm a little kid. I'm like eight or nine years old. We get to go to the uh, gift shop. And, you know, they had like a... Uh, Those crates contain valuable material, so grab everything you can. This place will be crawling with mutants any minute now. And uh, one of the things in the gift shop was a dinosaur claw, like a uh, replica of a fossil of a velociraptor claw, I believe. Or a, uh, no, it was like a dinosaur claw or something like that. And so I thought I wanted this, and I told my dad I wanted this. And he's like, okay, I'll buy this to you. And then, I, uh, and then I'm walking out of the museum gift shop and like, yeah, I'm going to use this to stab people. It'll be great. And he immediately stared at me, picked up the dinosaur claw, took it back to the museum, returned it and bought me a plushie instead. I guess figuring that I would be less likely to stab people. Uh, if I had a plushie. All right, let's see, what is, what is this? Okay, where's the crate? Okay, first crate is there. Second crate is there. Oh, so there's, all right, I think I see what I want to do. Uh, I think this is going to be a two squads hit and run. All right, where's my where's my heavy? Omar, uh, why don't you jump? Okay, jet jump. Up there.
will point zones. Okay. Ugh. Okay, we're back. Uh, what is... What is this thing? Mist Sentinel. Okay, let's see if I can get you... ...to kill this thing. Shoot. That's not really working. Uh, Jacob. Can you get a... I'm I want to I keep moving forward so that I can uh, hopefully start grabbing more more gear next round. Um, yeah, move up. Come get some. And shoot. Yeah, good. Alright, that laser weapon's not bad. Arena, why don't you... Finish the thing off. Whatever that does. <laughs> did Mocha hide his priorities in place? Yeah, I guess I did. Uh, I was looking for a toy that I could use to, you know... I was looking for something I could use to stab a bitch. My dad uh, disagreed with that. those priorities. Alright, let's see... Alright, we are going to get jumped by an Arthron. And what else? Alright, two Arthrons. Three Arthrons. Alright, I think there's two more boxes here and here. So let's see if we can... Let's see what we can get. Um, alright. Omar for, Oh, boy. You know, it really kind of sucks that you're so slow. We'll get you back under cover just in case and end your turn. Meanwhile, Jacob, uh, what's our first priority? Uh, you know what? Let's f let's just fight from here for for a round. Alright. Not bad. Uh, Sato. Actually, where's Irina? Okay, Irina. You get up to here and get to cover. Sophia. Alright. And where's Takeshi? Okay. Uh, I can overwatch after I shoot. So let's have you... Shoot the Arthron. And then I'll have you overwatch the Mindfragger. Yeah. Alright, the Arthron's got some pretty good speed, but he has to get up in melee. Alright, come on, kid it. Kill it. Nice. Alright, another Arthron. Jacob, uh, what do I need you to do? Alright, let's have you kill this, this thing here. God, this priority is in place. Priority murder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see if I can get the shot off. Come get some! Free aim. Oh wow, this... 
This laser rifle is pretty darn accurate, actually. Let's go. All right, Omar, you're gonna grab both of these, and then you're gonna. I think I'm gonna have you cut out. What do you mean, not enough action? Oh, I'm short, short action points. Okay. Um. Moving to coordinates. I've got this. I'm on the move. Fire. Okay, man, this rifle's not accurate at all. Can you get a shot off on this guy? Ready to engage. What do you mean you missed? That was a perfect shot. Okay. All right. Uh, we are gonna fight through to here. Here and cut out. Okay. Mm. Where's Omar? You're gonna gather up this. Drop that. Drop your extra ammo. Jacob, can you make it out all the way out here? I think you can. Inventory. Can I trade this with Jacob? Cost one action point. Jacob will cut out. Omar, I'm gonna have you move up. Uh, Takeshi, let's move you over to here. And can you get a shot on that? Uh, let's let's have you Overwatch. Get get you up there. And Irina. Um Is there a spot with good overhead that I can get you up to? And let's get you up to there, and then next round when it's time to run, I can have you use that exit. Okay. Oh boy, I don't like that. Okay, Jacob Eber, can you get... Rolling okay, out. I can get you line of sight onto this guy. Ready to engage. Alright. Nicely done. Uh, Omar, meanwhile, uh, can I get you to jump? Let's get you to jet jump. Mm, I don't like you jet jumping into an Arthron. Um, you got line of sight. Free aim. 50% chance of a headshot. Works it. Uh, did not make the make the hit. That's fine. Omar Asher, meanwhile, uh, we will have you press forward. So you'll be ready to fight next round. Keshi. Uh, you stay in. there. Sophia. Mm -hmm. 
gather up resources. What's this? Dash. Okay. So I can dash if I need to, but instead, let's overwatch here. And let's have you uh, move up to here. And overwatch this direction. You're not getting past me. Give me a uh, vision of Phyrexian in Ma Magic the Gathering. Yeah! They do kind of have a somewhat a Phyrexian look to them. Almost like thralls. Enemies that are too injured will flee the battlefield. Oh, that's neat. Okay. Now oh, where's Omar? Let's have you jump. I know how to Move, uh, Jacob. We'll have you move and Overwatch. Uh, Takeshi. We'll start a bounding run back to the uh, dust off point. And just in case anyone comes out here, I don't want them jumping to Keshi. Nothing's getting past me. And we'll just have you guys overwatch. Okay, so they're coming from this direction. That's not the worst. I think my guys can grab the gear and cut out. I'm on the move. Before it becomes a concern. Uh, grab. Grab that. I'm repositioning. And run. Let's have you dash. No have you dash twice. Uh, grab the stuff. Sato, not bad. Sophia, all right. Let's start let's making go. a run for it. Yeah, let's let's right start. There. Let's get ready to leave. That guy's coming in from this side. I don't think he'll be able to reach my guys before it becomes a concern. All right, Jacob. Book it. Omar. Book it. Let's do this. All right, you overwatch down this corridor. You overwatch in that direction. And Irina, you overwatch there just Nothing's in case he gets me. to. starts getting too close. Alright. Have you played this before? Is this your first run? This is actually my first run. Uh, I've. I've just played a lot of XCOM. Uh, Jacob, where are you? Do you have a shot? No, I don't. Alright, let's have you run. Let's go. You too, Omar. Uh, where's Irina? Uh, you 
shoot the guy if he comes out of that way. You shoot this guy if he comes this way. And you... Just be ready in case we get another enemy, which I don't think Nothing we will. But it's... Uh, it just died! Weird. Alright, can you make it out? Cool. Jacob, why don't you do that? Uh, you can't make it out, so I will just have you run. Yeah, everybody book it. We're, we are leaving! Took me this long to play it. I was waiting for all the DLC to come out and for so that I wouldn't have to buy like 15 different types of DLC. Honestly. Alright. Oh, yep. Knew it. Knew we were gonna get another one of those guys. The Triton. Oh boy. Sneaky flanky monsters. Omar still make it out there if he, I have him shoot? The answer appears to be no. So let's have Omar leave. Let's go. Sophia, I think. You might as well just take a shot. And then leave. I'm going in. Uh, base game. Alright. That worked out pretty well. Fuck ton of experience. Nice. Alright. Okay. Items recovered. Ooh, sniper magazines. An Odin grenade. And a bunch of resources. Nice. Losing one stamina point per turn. Max 10 per battle. Stamina falls below 20%. We'll suffer. Okay. Alright, let's go back home. Research. Uh, atmospheric analysis. Okay. Start. 13 hours. Someone please edit Mocha to make him bald, or I'll do it himself. Character creation is lots of fun to play around with. See so much potential for baldness. Curious long locks, cupcake. Please don't speak such evil. Uh, okay, Geoscape. Let's advance. Gonna slap his bald head. Oh no! Oh, did did I just make make it happen? Is that, that what it is? Okay. All right, reprogramming of our satellite systems has revealed uh, the new uh, uh, coastal sea regions. Activity level seems higher, posing a th serious threat to uh, remaining life on Earth. Havens caught within the mist will be at risk of attack. Defend any havens caught within them. Our geoscape monitoring systems have been updated with current mist. Okay. Uh, okay, so that's the mist. I guess that's my radar range. Got it. Uh, manufacturing. Actually, what is... Oh! 
Uh, dude gained a level. Brawler. Wait a minute. I can create a uh, guy with super duper uh, punchy. I could create a fucking super duper punchy dude. I kind of want to do this. Alright. Right, let's go to manufacturing. Let's make a med kit. Okay. Oh, that's actually making it right away. I was, I was expecting I'd have to wait. Instant. Duh. Okay. Uh-huh. All right. So, I, I guess this is the game. Mindfragger Autopsy. Mist Sentinel, Pandoran Evolution, Phoenix Archives. Let's do ha Phoenix Archives, and then we'll do Haven. Er All right, and then we'll do. Hmm. Yeah, I think this works. Okay, let's see. Um, personnel. Can I recruit new personnel? Oh, is it under... Okay, that's bases. What can I build? A research lab, storage, access lifts. Okay, I don't need to build an access lift. Fabrication plant, energy, training facility. Do I have a training facility? I do not. What do I need for a training facility? I do have a medical bay. Alright, let's 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 do a training facility. Let's talk about oh, diplomacy requires contact with another person. Uh this is my okay, this is my UFOpedia. That's not bad. Pandorans. Lots of information on monsters. Lots of information on weapons. Seems like all of the uh, information on armor. Equipment. The manticore and the scarab. Lore. Okay, huh. Nikolai and Stas, the head of the Sinidrion, Athena, Jara, Barnabas, the disciples of Anu, the keeper of the Taxiarch Nergal, and then this must be New Jericho. Huh. Randolph Symes is the... Born and raised in Fairfax, California! Huh! Bald kill roots. Kieran said box braids, please. Have you ever tried before? Uh, no, I have not, actually. Uh, any class can wear any armor. The first mist. Okay. Hmm. Alright. Uh, let's... Let's explore. Let's do this. Ah, uh, Sinidrion uh, Louverture. The situation is tense. Someone figured out that our open and democratic society it would be easy to infiltrate and steal from. They pretended to join us and made off with some critical research. 
I said they made off, but the truth is they didn't get very far. In fact, they're stuck in the haven. But as you can imagine, this is a strange situation. These people pretended to be our friends. We They lived in Louverture for months, all to make a profit. I suppose old ha habits die hard. Could insist, assist Synedrian with this problem. Okay. Stop a group of thieves who have stolen critical research. Yeah, let's give this a shot. Let's see if we can make some friends with Sanidrian. Uh, I think this is going to stay the way it is. Because if they're... I, I like that laser rifle that I got from uh, the start. I feel like uh, it would be nice to have more of those. So maybe if I make friends with Sanidrian, they'll give me more of those laser rifles. I do have to say, I do really like the design of the Manticore. Okay, let's see. Oh, this looks familiar! Yeah, this really looks familiar. This looks a lot like an XCOM 1 or 2 mission. Oh boy. Okay, let's see. Um, let's start off by looking around, looking around. Okay. Um, I want to get, I want to get, um, let me see if I can get Irina into a high position. Into high ground. Is there any way? Uh, maybe I can get her a, one of those jet packs. Or jet jumps. Alright, well, I can't do that now, but what I can do is I can jet jump this guy up to here. See if he can get eyes on anything. The answer is no. Uh, Irina, however, uh, can confirm that this spot should be safe. So I'm going to have her run up to the uh, upper floor. Uh, Takeshi... Uh, Jacob... little worried about a flank, but I don't think they're, they're going to come from there. And Sophia. Now, I hope they're not in here, because otherwise I just set myself up to get shot in the back. Alright, let's see. Okay, there you are. Yeah, you just walked, ran straight into five Phoenix operatives, buddy. Okay, so there is somebody inside. And somebody up in this corner. Okay. Let's see. Uh, Omar. Uh, I wonder... How do I get... Well, first, let's handle the dude that's, like, right in front of me. Uh, free aim. I can't one-shot him. Oh! But I can get a bunch of damage in. Lining up a shot. All right, let's free aim. Let's go for that. <coughs> Alright. Uh, meanwhile, Takeshi... Sato, you're fine. Uh, let's have you overwatch... down that way in case anyone comes up. Jacob, meanwhile, uh, where can I put you? Uh, let's have you I'm go to move. here check to see if this guy comes down this way. Omar, meanwhile. Uh, let me have you overwatch. Bet you're gonna... You might come that way. Sophia. I'll have 
have you cover this way. Area covered. We'll see how this goes. All right. You didn't get sight. Okay, uh, there's one of those thieves. He's shooting. He doesn't seem to be able to get a line of sight. Okay, let's see. Omar. Not a fan of this. We'll see. Okay. Deal some damage. Uh, Sato. You're not getting past me. Where's Irina? Um Irina. have you get up to here oh finger on the trigger yeah uh, should have known uh, brown I don't like the fact that I'm all, all my guys are pinned in here I need to kind of break out um yeah get to Get to here. What's what's her will? Eleven. Okay, Jacob. Rolling out. I'm gonna have you overwatch this in case the guy comes up through that way. Uh All right. Oh. oh, you you hit my friend? All right. Oh, oh, Jacobs. Yeah. Uh, oh, no, that's Takeshi. Takeshi's in bad shape. I think Sato might not survive this. This is gonna be this is gonna be a tough one. Uh, where's Sato? All right, you I'm, get up, uh, get over to I'm here. You'll be just uh, heal Sato. Ready to engage. Uh, free aim. Shoot this guy. Sato. Give a shot. Oh, come on! Oh, that was bullshit. Uh, whatever. Uh, Irina. Okay, it looks like the fight's gonna take place here, so I'm gonna have you drop back down to here and uh, use the pistol. Shot you in the groin. I mean, I'm not bad. I'm gonna have you check that. You're fine. Omar. I don't know how am I supposed to get get that guy. Um Oh wait, I can punch him, can't I? What does a bash cost? One action point. So let's see. One two Three, four. So I can't actually get up there. What I can do on my way is move here and overwatch that so that if he comes in, he gets a face full of laser. Uh, meanwhile, get some. 
Let's see if I can see what I can do. Uh, let's aim for the leg. Maybe I can take out the leg. Yeah. And I think he's bleeding. Okay. That guy did not come around the corner. Uh, Sato. Let's see. Irina, do you have any shots on this guy? Any way I can get a shot? All right, let's just have you finish him, him off. Finger on the trigger. Mm, that was a good kill. Oh wait, the pistol only costs one action point. That's pretty good. Uh, okay, Sato. You know what, Takeshi, get over to here. Let's narrow down your overwatch cone. And if he shows up through that doorway, shoot him. Meanwhile, Jacob... If he tries to exit this way... You shoot him. Fuck game mechanics, just rip off his legs. Uh, Omar, uh, where can I... Can I get... Can I get to this guy and just... Sock him in the face? Clearly not. All right, what I'll do? Gotta be I'll quick. move him to here. I do kind of wish that it wasn't my like heavy hitter dude that ended up with the punchy power. Uh, yeah, if you if he comes on out the door. Just shoot him. I'm uh, going one. In. I'll fire. <gasps> and then take cover. Alright. Knew it! Uh-oh. Oh, you're shooting at Sato? You son of a bitch. You shot Sato! You fucking asshole. You know what? I would. Except I feel like... Omar... Omar's not going to get line of sight on this guy. You know what? Let's just shoot him. What do you mean? Don't. Oh. Buckle it. Um. Alright, I'll just have Jacob flank and shoot from here. While he's at it... Aim for the groin. Ah, Get better punchy guys soon enough. Yeah. Hey, Sato leveled! Ah! Brown was one, clo one point away from leveling. That sucks. The fuck is that? All right. So yeah, I'm really actually enjoying this. Um, Hi there. My name is Athena, hmm. and I'd like to thank you on behalf of Synedrion as a whole. You know, Outsiders sometimes think of Synedrion 
as a bunch of naive, helpless people hmm. living in a big bubble. And I know we can appear that way, but the truth is, we are more like a powder keg. Trying to build a truly democratic society without hierarchies involves a lot of arguing. The terraformers want one thing, the polyphonic tendency another. Hmm. Zara clashes with Nikolai, Stas tries to keep everyone calm, every haven has a totally different set of priorities, and then something like this happens. I'm being honest about our flaws, because I think, crazily enough, the whole thing works. We've built something remarkable, given everything we've been through, and the Phoenix Project could help us really make a difference on this wretched planet. Hmm. Think about it, please. We have a lot in common, and here's your payment. We believe in people being rewarded for their labor. I like that. Acts of solidarity do not require payment. Then you have our gratitude. Hmm. A plus three. 65 tech. I don't know what 65 tech means. What is this? What's Helios 2? Alright, let's take a look at my crew. Oh. Extreme focus. Confirm. Dash. Bombardier. Healer. You know what? I think you're going to end up being my medic. Sato. Inflict Aleph no to the power of 10 points of damage. Ho ho ho. Omar's fine, Sophia. Ooh, she can get sniper rifle proficiency. That might be neat. Before that, though, let's give you some strength and speed. Omar, I'll give you. You need speed. Nine, I'll give you what's willpower again? Ah, will. All right. Let's take a look at the research. Ah. Okay, I can reverse engineer a Cindidrian laser pistol. All right. Now let's continue. Um, how badly is my dude injured? Hit points, stamina. Uh, I'll explore one more before I start turning back. Alright, Fort Liberty is a haven run by New Jericho. Oh, sp points on stats. Yeah, I, I noticed that. Uh, which means normally things are quiet and under control, but right now there's an emergency. A group of soldiers is on a killing spree. Uh-huh. Strange dreams, voices heard in the night. If we stop these soldiers, New Jericho will undoubtedly be grateful to us. Stop a group of rampaging soldiers. Okay. Uh, stamina, hit points. Uh, what is... Why is there a... Oh, because cause I'm uh, I'm not at max stamina. Okay. Um, I think I'll try this one, and then I think I'll head back. This might be a mistake. I might end up... Uh, getting my ass kicked. I guess we'll see. Why don't I save my game? Okay. Alright, um, what am I foreseeing? 
Alright, let's take a look. So this is the battle zone. Um, I think my number one concern is going to be this building. Um, there's also the rooftop. I don't want to go through this courtyard. That looks like a death trap. Uh, let's... Let's punch up in this room, fight our way through here, and then use this as an overwatch position. I'm prepared. Arena. There, there. Madman, huh? Okay. Uh, brownie. Alright, somebody on the roof as well as down here. Um, where can you get line of sight onto this guy? Should have brought a grenade. Ah, uh, well. That corner, uh, Jacob. I'll be right there. Get to here and Overwatch, in case anyone tries to drop down behind us. Area cover. Omar, meanwhile. Yeah, same deal. I don't want anyone dropping down behind us. Takeshi. Need some sleep? Eh, don't worry. We'll, like... Make sure that this gets put up on the, uh... Twitch thingamajig. Alright, let's see if... Not a bad move. Enemy is in Overwatch. Oh, okay, so they can Overwatch too. Yeah. Ow, that's not good. That's not good. Oh boy. Oh, that's gonna be a problem. Uh, let's think about what's the best way to get there. Where's Irina? Have you... Can you shoot? No. Oh, I can overwatch him with a pistol for free. Nothing's getting past me. Now I wonder... This might end up being a bad idea. Okay, that worked. Alright, we need to figure out how I'm going to kill this guy up top here. Uh... Oh, he's got return fire on him or something like that. Hang on a minute. I can try a thing. Where's Omar? Why don't you jet jump? I know how to Up to here. And now let's punch a man. Oh. 
Oh! Okay, so that actually deals some damage. Meanwhile... Come get some! Should be, he should be dead soon. Uh, let's. Uh, let's just I'll have you right duck around the corner. Uh, and let's end this. Yes, I, I do want to end the turn. Okay. He's gonna come on up. He's gonna. Why does everyone she keep shooting at Takeshi? What the fuck did he do? Okay, so he killed a guy, but you know, so did Omar. But the past videos got. Uh, videos can only be alive ten days. Um, I've actually got some of those videos uh, saved. So, if you're looking for some of the older stuff, I might be able to get that to you guys. Just, uh... Yeah, don't count on it yet. Um... My... Oh! They all have return fire, I guess. Okay! I did not know that. That's good to know. Okay. Fuck that shit. Uh, I'm punching you to death. Yeah, uh, I I'm, I'm considering putting up some of the older videos on YouTube. Um, we shall see. Just don't know if I want to get involved in another ecosystem. Um. I had always assumed hmm. the Phoenix Project would return one day, even after Symes disappeared. It seems to be the defining pattern of your history. Fall, then rise again. I wonder if this points to an underlying weakness or an underlying strength. I suppose time will have to tell. Time and the choices you make. After all, you are not necessarily defined by what has come before. You can be whatever your will allows you to be. That is the essence of the human experience. Okay, that's that's really interesting, uh, Tobias West. But your guys went crazy and started shooting people. Don't, aren't you worried, weirded out that by that? That's why I did not intervene. We could have stopped those soldiers ourselves easily enough, but I needed you to see, to understand that far more is at stake here than just our ecosystem or our genetic purity. We are being robbed of what makes us human, our will. I fear neither the Utopians at Sinedrian nor those Anu fanatics really understand that. If you can recognize the real nature of the threat, perhaps we can work together on stopping it. Yeah, all I got to say with that is, okay. That's just weird. All right, let's go back to base and get our guys healed up. And also... Oh, diplomacy. Aha! Uh -huh. I see. So it seems that I can decide to uh, accept missions against one of the other factions in exchange for helping out uh, another one. Uh huh. Okay. 
All right, let's uh, let's see what you got. Farsighted. I think I like. Let's do. Let's do. Let's give you sniper training because I feel like you would you would like. I think you would do well with uh, precision weaponry. And I think. Yeah, let's do extreme focus. Confirm. All right. Uh, where's my next guy? Sophia Brown. Yeah, you def I definitely want return fire. I don't know if I want to put you on sniper rifles. Omar's fine. Takeshi. Yeah, definitely want you to get return fire. Irina's fine. Who's got the better perception? Brown. You know what, Sophia? Let's do this. I feel like the Synedrian armor has just been working out well. Flagathon. You, I guess, Golem armor. And my sniper. Okay, so anyone can wield, can wear any armor, but I guess the uh, which the the one that's for their classes is. Uh, better. Okay. Shred shock. Hell 2, Hell 2. Tier 1, damage 60. Shred 5, shock 5. Ammo capacity 6 rounds, ammo capacity 12 rounds. Thanks to use single shot. As opposed to three round burst. You know, actually, I think I kind of want to see how you. Let's do this. We'll put that. You know, we'll have everyone keep a. Grenade on there. Actually, Sato is my medic, right? Here. Uh, Irina. Have a grenade. Jacob. Sophia. Omar. Okay, there we go. Bases under construction, research, researching, Air Force. All right. Uh, oh, I can put storage. All right. Rename this vehicle. I know it's the Manticore One, but it can really be only named one thing. This is the Sky Ranger. No weapons, no modules. All right, let's wait until all my guys are patched up. What the fuck is this? Alright, I don't think I want to hang out with the Disciples of Anu.
Six hours until Phoenix Archives. Okay, let's just keep going. Research complete. Okay, clean Phoenix Point is now the only operating Phoenix base. There's no uh, sign of Randolph Signs, but he has left something potentially useful for us. Randolph Signs was the last leader of the Phoenix Project. His great-grandfather had been there when it was founded, and he was there to witness its end. Hmm. When we took back Phoenix Point, we found his notes. In his final days, as the world collapsed around him, he'd been working frantically to understand the Pandora virus. Somewhere in the complicated history of the project, in decades of missions and investigations, there had to be an answer. His notes were damaged, too many of the files corrupted. Hmm. But perhaps, if we could retrace his steps, we could figure out where his journey had taken him, and what the answers he had discovered would mean, would mean for us. Okay, critical Phoenix objectives are marked with the Phoenix Point symbol. Taking this course is not the only path to victory. Okay, site added to Geoscape, Symes Retreat. Base from the menu. Okay, eliminate enemy forces to gain access to the Symes retreat. I feel like before I do that, I want to do Haven recruitment protocols and Let's do human population census, this Pandoran evolution. Uh, okay, I don't know what pace I need to be at in this game. How does... One recruit... New soldiers is the question. Bases. Okay. What else can I build? A medical bay, store, access lift, fabrication plant, training facility, living quarters. I've got living quarters. Energy generator. Okay. Um, let's wait until my guys are healed up. And then I'll go explore something new. We can now recruit soldiers from Havens. Excellent. Send your aircraft to a so Haven with a recruit soldier icon next to it. Select Haven info. Okay. I see. So I can now recruit from like Sanedrian. Let's do that. Let's recruit from Sanedrian. Then let's go to the next spot. Haven info. Steal an aircraft? Huh. Raid. Recruit soldier. Okay, let's take a look. Military strength 11. Who did I get? Mustafa Davies, level 1 assault. Alright. What is he carrying us? Deimos ARL. Right, I'm gonna need some more Deimos ARL mags. Uh, let's not raid them, let's not steal an aircraft. Alright, let's go up and let's explore a new unexplored site. Explore. Ah, the Disciples of Anu, Haven of Harbidum. A mutated worm ex infestation. Alright, eradicate the infestation ourselves, help the Haven, and create a good first impression with this faction. 
Alright, let's go for this. Oh, Takeshi's still down a few hit points. I do kind of like this guy's style. He, he He's clearly a Chargers fan. Or maybe a Bruins fan. Alright, let's go. Realistic ballistic model means each bullet has its own trajectory and will do damage independently of any other bullets fired in a burst. Nice. Alright, let's save this game. And then let's see what happens. Okay, that's a worm. Alright, let's have you just fire at it. What do you mean I can't see the worm? Easy piece. Not bad. That's two. Uh, let's have you just wait. Um, who's got line of sight on this guy? Omar. Here I come. Looking for uh, an angle. Let's just get a Yeah, let's just have you overwatch that. Uh, I'm gonna have you move up, switch to your pistol, and go to overwatch there. Move it. Sato. Let's have you go to Overwatch here. Here I am. And Eber. Uh, don't father fire your weapon. Uh, Overwatch. Let's have you Overwatch there. Nothing's getting past me. Let's see how this goes. All right. So the poison worm is running. This guy is alerted. Right, I'm gonna have them do. I think I'm gonna have have my guys go in three group, two groups of three. Oh boy, that's not great. There's a lot of them. Okay, Davies. Um. That's not good. Asher. Actually, let's see, let's have you throw a grenade. See how well that works. That works pretty well. So let's see, I can spend... I'll be right there. One point to get here. Finger on the trigger. Fire shot at that worm. And I still have points to... Overwatch this Area direction. Covered. Brown, Sophia moves to here. Uh, fire at that. Good shot. Um, let's 
Let's have you rest up. Irina. Rolling out. Uh, how many action points do you have left? Two. Come get some. Uh, clearly I'm out of range. Shoot. Overwatch. Sato. Let's see how this goes. Two of these guys. Uh, all right, Davies, move up and just shoot this. In my sights. What was that all? On my way. I do wonder why Mustafa Davies has a Russian accent. Fire. Is that really the best they can All do? All right, there we go. All right, two more levels. Not bad. I do feel like I'm going to have to stop using those Synodrian rifles soon unless I can get more ammo for them. Um... See. Normally, when we encounter a potential ally, we first send the Apostle to the Onceborn to check him out. But I'm going to break protocol to say thanks. Now listen, uh -huh. I'll be honest with you. The Exalted is the only one who has any real answers. Tobias West may be clever and Sinedrian may sound great, but only the Exalted is dealing with the world as it actually is. She can lead us out of this mess. Give us lives worth living. Fucking cults. You know what? I'm gonna keep friendly with them until I turn on them and stab their back. If you want to work with us, you'll still have to deal with the hierarchy. Work your way up from the Apostle to the Onceborn, to the Keeper of the Threshold, all the way up to the Synod of Yearning and the Exalted herself. That's hard work. You'll have to earn the knowledge you gain. But trust me, it'll be worth it. And if the Synod gives you trouble, let me know. Okay. War cry. All their action points are reduced to two for a round. Farsighted. You know, I think I like farsighted. And you know what? Let's give them war cry too. Although, hmm. yeah. Mustafa Davies. Uh. Okay. Let's boost his speed. Okay, continue on. Let's explore. A little further. I think I'll do... What is this? Hmm. Okay. So I can choose to raid and attack various places instead of just make What's friends with them. Sinedrian is an amalgamation of blah 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 blah. They're democratic, they're techie, and they're Weirdos. Got it. Sinedrian was built on a dream. A world without hierarchies. Without leaders. Where human beings could embrace the potential of technology without its destructive side effects. The radicals of the old world had been proven right. The status quo could not sustain itself. But what now? What was the next step? Some argued for coexistence with the Pandoran ecosystem. 
hoping for a peaceful solution. Others advocated putting humanity before nature and claiming the planet for themselves. Trusting in the safety of their havens, the people of Sanhedrin argued about the best way forward. But the Pandora virus had little interest in their arguments, mm -hmm. and its power was still growing. Mm -hmm. You see a little person class, you can recruit someone from there, yeah. I, uh, I did notice that. Uh, I think I already recruited a guy from here. Alright, let's explore this site. Let's see what I get from here. Ah. I guess I could raid these guys. You know, let's not do that just yet. Let's, for now, uh, explore these areas. See what else we can find. Ah, Fort Zeus. I want a book written by Randolph Symes. Agree to the trade. Tech minus 20. Sure. Research 125. Okay. That's actually pretty good. Let's explore this area. A highly fortified skyscraper. Fortified by the owners of a hedge fund. Huh. Rich fuckers. Nice. They apparently died from voluntarily drinking non-filtered water. Of course they did. Uh, what the fuck is this? Well, that's not good. Earlier today, a meteor crashed into Earth, causing great damage and widespread panic. Mount Egg. Okay. Bye-bye, North Africa. <laughs> it, it, it's more like, uh, you know, Colorado. Yeah, Colorado seems to have gotten hit by a freaking meteor. That's pretty cool. Research complete. Research complete. Uh, Synedrian laser pistols. Fantastic. I can now make Synedrian laser pistols. Uh, close, and let's research... Uh, let's research Haven trade protocols. In fact, let's move move it up. I want to be able to trade with Havens. Right. Oh, the FMV was different. LOL. Okay. So, you are the Phoenix Project, eh? I've heard a lot about you. Hmm. Who am I? Well, the maker, of course. Mystery Flesh Pit National here. Park. I love Mystery Flesh Pit Welcome National Park. Welcome to the marketplace. Here and only here you will find some very special hardware. I design, build, and test every piece mm -hmm. of equipment here with my own two hands, you see. <laughs> I will be honest, they tend to explode every now and again, these uh, the toys of mine. Mm -hmm. They do make some pretty fireballs, though. <laughs> Both when they work and uh, when they suddenly stop working. What did I find? The marketplace. 
The Obliterator Chaos Assault Rifle. What is this thing? An abandoned scarab that he wants to get his hands on. You know what? Let's do this mission and then let's call it a night. Alright, preliminary scouting of the area has... However, it seems to be inactive. We must deploy our troops and find a way to get it running. Alright, looks like our boys are... Looks like our troops are ready. Let's take a look at their gear. the squad. See how they do. Save. Okay. I will have to say this. It feels a little bit weird to be playing an XCOM style game that I'm not like running into horrible glitches every few seconds. Is this... Uh, find the access codes, so that must be it first. And then recover the vehicle. I don't see where the vehicle is. I, I bet it's in here. Okay, I think we've got a mission. Uh, let's... Target located. Alright, let's have you fall back. Right there. Let's see if Sato can get a shot on him. Come get some. Not bad. Date Mustafa. Let's see if you can just press forward. Irina. What are we looking at here? Uh, free aim. Yeah, I feel like even if I miss the headshot, I should be able to get well, somewhere else. Is that really the best thing? Nice. And Omar, they can't stop me. keep pushing. And let's go. Uh, yeah, there's somebody else out there. Yeah, Arthron, a mind fragger. All right, let's just kill that thing. Oh boy, I forgot about that. And a Triton Strangler. Okay. Alright, let's start with... Omar. Uh, bash him. And let's war cry. Stuck behind cover. Uh, Irina, do you have line of sight on anything? All right, then let's switch you to your pistol. Uh, let's see. 
let's move you up. Can you fire at anything? No. Nothing's getting past me. Uh, where's Sophia? I'm on the move. Oh, that doesn't sound good. I think my cat is throwing up. That's not going to be fun later. Alright, get the shot. Uh, Jacob. These guys might be able to close in on me. Alright. Oh boy, Mustafa's gonna get punched. That's not good. All set. You know what? Back up. And shoot him. Free aim. And push forward a bit. Okay, Sophia. How do I get a line of sight on him? Rolling out. Roll out. Finger on the trigger. And shoot. Nice. Keshi, get to here, and I want you to overwatch this position. Uh, here I am. And I'll have you overwatch the other side of the. You overwatch this side of the L. Area covered. Arena. Moving in quick. Get to here. How many does she have? Three. Overwatch that. Omar. Stay back here. Wasn't too bad. All right, where? Oops. Well, that seems familiar. Accidentally overclicking by one square. All right, Brown. All right, let's just start double time in it. Should be okay, it was a pain in some way. How old are they? Uh, Acrian, I'm not sure exactly what you're asking. How old are what's? Oh, the cats? Uh, one of them's around 12. Watch out, I'm moving in. Uh, the other one's like seven. The uh, older one has had uh, stomach troubles all his life. It's hard for him to keep down food. He barfs a lot, so... It's not unexpected to hear him start throwing up, but it's never a good... It's never something you want to hear, you know? Maximum effort. Target in sight. Target in... Oh. Taking aim. Uh... Yeah. Rolling out. And these Synedrian guns are pretty good. Alright, let's move up behind cover here. And I want Davies to move up to here. And let's overwatch this side. Arena. 
You'll move up to here. And you'll overwatch that side. Omar, I want you here for a moving reserve. In case anything comes out. Yeah. The, uh, out of the two cats, uh, this one and that one, uh, this one has the terrible habit of eating a whole bunch of freaking grass and then just barfing it all up. Let's go. Uh, that one's just got the annoying habit of, you know, uh, just, you know, that, that one just has health problems. I am slightly... Oh, enemy spotted? Uh, what is it? Oh boy, that could be a problem. Alright, uh, I should have known better than to just diddy bot my way in there. Alright. Um... Yeah, let's have you overwatch like this. Maybe you'll be able to catch him before he gets to us. All right, and Omar. No time to waste. You'll move up to here. I think my guys are gonna get, one of my guys is gonna get clawed up by a monster. I pushed up too far without checking to see whether they'd be around. All right, now, yep. He took the path that takes me that avoids the overwatch. Alright, he's gonna claw up. Yep, knew it. I seriously injured and in need of assistance. I see it. First thing you're gonna do, Jacob. Uh which one of you guys is uh Takeshi's my medic, the guy who I set up as my medic. Uh Takeshi, where's... What's our move? Well, first of all, you're gonna move to here. And you're gonna heal up Jacob. Uh, secondly... Right there. You're gonna move on. Next up, Jacob. I think you should get the chance... ...to take revenge. Now let's push. I'm on the move. Moving to coordinates. Overwatching. A uh, switch. And we'll move up. Omar, you do the same. Yeah. Now let's go get into that damn truck. Oh! Yeah, I knew I should have checked that line. I'm done line. Yeah, let's kill this thing. Uh, fire. Huh. Uh, where's Jacob Bieber? Let's go. Okay, let's see if we can kill this thing. Uh, where...
Where's Mustafa? I think... I think Mustafa can get a kill on this guy. Identifying target. Let's shoot him up the ass. Let's have him leave. I don't like that mind... F that mind fucker. Where's Irina? I think Irina can get line of sight on the... Come get some. On the Strangler. Good job. Uh, Sophia. Uh, first Takeshi. Uh, Overwatch. That way. Open. And Sophia. You overwatch this way. And Davies. Uh, can you get out? Yeah, confirm. And I'll have the truck move back this way. Get ready to uh, pick ev pick everybody up. Okay. Nice. I'm on the move. New positioning. Arena. That's not a fact. Actually, I'm on the move. Yes. And meanwhile, the scarab. Run. Oh boy, enemy approaching. Uh, let's get you out of here. Alright, do you walk them or where's the grass coming from? Uh, we have a lawn outside. We let the cat cats run around a little bit. Uh, we also um, grow some cat grass for them uh, in little quantities. It's not bad for them, but she tends to just keep eating. She's a little glutton. All right. When factions and relations reach 50, you are aligned. That faction will share its research with you. All right, all Good right. job, Phoenix. Uh, I will be taking that scarab if you don't mind. Uh, what will I do with it? Mm -hmm. Improve it, of course. It's so dull and boring right now. It needs a bit more flair. Oh, no. Next time you're at the marketplace, keep your eyes open for the improvements. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Then let's go back home. Let's get my troops healed up. And let's level you up too. Uh, what can I get? Quick aim. Yeah, let's have you get quick aim. Willpower, will points, strength. Mm. 
Let's raise your willpower. I don't think I need. No. Yeah, I think that's good. Triton autopsy. Haven trade protocols in three hours. Let's get that, and then let's call it a night. While many settlements may have needs that we could meet, we have to establish good relations and show that we're not potential swindlers or raiders before they'll consider engaging in trade with us. Okay, ah, I, I see. All right, I think I'm gonna call it a night. Let's save my, let's save. Then let's go ahead and quit the game. I do have to say, I am a big fan. Um, I kind of like what they what they've done with this game. Um, it's not as polished as the Firaxis XCOM games. Um, it's not as, uh, how do I put it? It's not as, um, it's not as streamlined and the production values are not as high, but it seems to have a lot more depth. I'm a big fan of the whole faction system. That's always a lot of, that's been a lot of fun. And, um, hmm. I think my favorite thing about this game so far is, honestly, that free aim system. Can't be every day you claim... <laughs> I guess I should change that up. Um... But yeah, a uh, good game. A uh, lot of fun. Uh... Probably will stream that again. Maybe I, 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 I honestly, I'll be probably playing more of that offline. Uh, but yeah, good game. Really enjoyed it. All right, I'm gonna call it a night, and uh, hope you guys uh, have a good one, and uh, enjoy the rest of your day or your evening, whatever your time zone is. Uh, peace out and. Uh, would I recommend this or one or XCOM two? Um, in all honesty, I would recommend out of all of these games, the first Firaxis XCOM game first, e XCOM Enemy Within, and uh, XCOM uh, uh, sorry, not uh, Enemy Unknown and Enemy Within. Um, I feel like that one, if you're just getting into the XCOM series, is probably the uh, best place to start. Uh, after that, you can play XCOM 2. But here's the problem with XCOM 2. Um, in XCOM 1, uh, Fire Access 1, they discovered that um, you can beat a lot of the levels by using Overwatch, standing back, and shooting the enemy as they approach you. Um, they wanted to fix that in XCOM 2. Uh, and they did it in the worst way possible. They put time limits on certain levels, so you have to beat them within a certain number of uh, rounds or you lose. Uh, which, in my opinion, took away a lot of the interest. One of the most popular mods for that game, aside from Long War, is one which either lengthens the amount of time you have to do those timed missions or takes out the timer entirely. Um, I played it with the timer on because my play style was very aggressive and I really enjoyed the extra challenge, but I understand why people don't like it because it means that you kind of have to play the way that the game creators want you to play. Um, I would definitely play uh, Phoenix Point third after trying out XCOM 1 and XCOM 2. Um, I would 
say XCOM Chimera Squad is fun if you want to just play a game without the soldier customization. Uh, Chimera Squad has, uh, what is it, pre-made characters and it has a set storyline. So that one's not a bad place to start either. Uh, yeah, Blarg J. Uh, yeah, I am uh, very, very aware of those discussions we had about the timed missions. Uh, and I had to say, I understood your frustration. Um, yeah, I will say one of the things to get used to, especially with XCOM 2, is um, get used to losing your favorite guys. And be ready to just have your guys get killed. Uh, Phoenix Point has been pretty lenient about getting my guys killed so far. I imagine that will change when the game uh, continues and later levels get harder. But all in all, um, I'm really enjoying it. Looking forward to playing it some more. And uh, yeah, uh, I kind of see, see how it's a it's, a it's kind of a different take from XCOM 1 and 2, uh, the Fire Axis XCOM. The Fire Axis games are very polished. They're very clean. They're very easy to play. Um, not to say that the game is, you know, isn't difficult. Uh, it's that, you know, you don't have to juggle so many things. Um, especially on the strategy layer. Uh, the, um, yeah, Phoenix Point has a lot more complexity. Um, it's got a lot more strategy going on to it. And uh, the faction system is going to make things interesting. All right, in any case, uh, I should call it. Good night, everybody. Peace.